The dramatic video of the suspect arrested after being on the run for hours. 39-year-old Nestro Gabriel Caballero hangs his head as he's taken into custody outside the McDonald's in West Lynn. Police say he researched Gert Boyle, the famous co-founder of Columbia Sportswear. He um, showed up at the, at, in the driveway as she pulled in to open up the garage and go into her house. Uh, he had a, a gift basket and said, oh, this is, I can't remember the organization because I have a gift basket for a fruit basket for you. And she's like, I'm not interested, thanks. He goes, oh, I'd like you to sign my book too. She's sorry, not interested. And then he takes a gun out and says, get in the house. Everyone agrees the suspect picked the wrong woman, the matriarch of Columbia Sportswear, seen here in a commercial with her son. The liner zips in for maximum warm. In the 70s, Boyle took over operations at Columbia Sportswear after her husband passed away, kicking off the Tough Mother campaign. Gert's very resourceful. Uh, obviously, uh, over her lifetime, she's proven I think in many ways, in many uh, situations, just how resourceful she is. So resourceful that instead of punching the code to disarm her alarm, she punched in a private code, sending a message to police. They must have known who she was. It's the talk of the community in West Lynn, the second home invasion in just weeks. Everyone is wondering who the suspect is and how one tough mother is doing. Columbia Sportswear spokesperson says, She's just fine. I'm reminded of just what a personality and an icon she is, just with the outpouring of support from the community locally, but more than that, from around the world.